we're filming a little video for John Wick 2 called Dog Wick. John Wick gets killed and his dog takes revenge on all the guys who killed John Wick. There's gonna be a lot of stunts by MC Monkeys. We got one day to shoot this trailer and we have a lot to shoot. We're working with a dog who can be unpredictable. So, you know, we'll do our best, make those shots look as good as we can make them, and we're gonna have a lot of fun. So, let's do it. So the first part of the day, we're in this uh, park, shooting uh, all the outdoor daytime stuff. So it's gonna be dog digging up, it's weapons cache, it's gonna be dog playing fetch, and then also bad guys approaching the dog house, and like dead in the dog house, which is not really, not, not really. All right, talent sunset, guys. This is Scout, one of our little terrier dogs. He's gonna be doing a lot of running, some digging, chasing bad guys, saving the day. We put a uh, like a, 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 a land of the box here, so if you can just sort of dig out sort of middle right around here. We'll just have to show her a couple times. Yeah, go for it. She's, she's, she's Scout, come here. Sit. Sit. Stay. Just sitting here, and then we're just gonna move this out of the way for the shot. We're looking for a house that was like similar to the John Wick house in the movie. Big windows and sort of big open air, modern looking kitchen. We're gonna wait for nightfall to do the action stuff, but in the meantime, there's a little some more pieces we're gonna pick up here. So this is the morning scene. This is when John wakes up and everything's looking great because he's got his dog with him. And he's ready to go out for a day at the park with his dog. Things are looking good. So this is the happy moments. This is the happy moments. You want to get a clean without Brett in it? I think he wants to see him, but... Uh, or do you get one more? Let's do one, let's do one more. Brett, uh, let Brett take like two more steps before we set Scout. You don't want to spend time doing a big suspense beat there. It needs to be him waking up and he needs to just come into three guys are walking up holding a gun at him. Maybe have a guy behind him who cracks him back. That's what happens. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. The guy goes down. Boom. Over. And then just standing over him. Shoes. <laughs> they should just. They should. Yeah, they should. They should stand. <laughs> I didn't know about them standing over him and holding a gun up. So if you one top one one version would be just shoot him once, but the other one would be just unload on him. <laughs> <laughs> and just everyone. Yeah. yeah, just everybody just going nuts. Everybody. Every role Brett plays, he always gets killed. He always gets shot or stabbed or something. Just another day at work. Just a yeah. 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 dead man on the floor. Uh, this is actually the first time Scout's an awesome dog, trained, and uh, it's been it's been quite the process. It's been really nice working with a, a professional animal. Dog is definitely the best though. He's spot on every time. This is the first time we're doing a more like beat by beat action sequence. Uh, on Rock Show the Show, we did a horse race, so it wasn't necessarily an action sequence per se, but we were using trained animals, we were doing you know a lot of running and jumping and stuff like that. So we've worked with animals before, uh, working with a dog is much more fun and interesting. The general challenge is just the unknown, basically. Uh, you never know exactly how long things are going to take. They are animals after all, so you have to you know, be patient with them as they like learn through exactly what you want. You have to know, you have to be flexible with uh, the limitations. So if they can't do exactly what you're thinking, it's okay, well, how do they do it? And then how do I achieve whatever I want that way? You know, so it's just being flexible is the key, basically. Uh, so obviously, so we have like an idea of what we want uh, the dog to do. We block it out and then we sort of figure out, okay, we get up to here pretty easily, and then we figure out what's to come around it, and then we'll make it a long continuous thing. My neck is like so. Yeah. Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. Oh. 
Dude, it's like, it's just like right here, it's like, 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 uh, this is a fun one. This is a very dumb idea, but, but by dumb, very dumb, I mean very good. Yeah. But it was definitely one of those ones where it's like we came up with and everyone was just cracking up, coming up with stuff. Yeah. I was a little worried going into it because I yeah. didn't know about the dog. I didn't know what the dog could do. We've had, you know, we've done some stuff with, you know, cats and dogs in the past, but like. It's unpredictable, right? It's a little unpredictable. This was uh, one of the more ridiculous yeah, ideas yeah. we've ever had. And, then I can, and we actually got to do it, so it was awesome. More, more of this stuff in the future. Good job. Good job. Everybody at once. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Okay, whoa. Okay, ready? And three, two, one, go. One more. Three, two, one, go. Okay. <laughs>